Hey guys! Unlock the secrets to successful scalping with our comprehensive guide to the ultimate scalping indicator on TradingView. In this video, we dive deep into the best buy and sell indicator specially designed for scalpers looking to maximize their trading potential. Learn how to effectively utilize this powerful tool to identify entry and exit points with precision. Whether you're a seasoned trader or just starting out, our step-by-step -step tutorial will provide you with the insights you need to enhance your trading strategy. Key topics covered in this video include Introduction to the Scalping Indicator How to set up the indicator on TradingView Real-time examples of buy and sell signals Tips for improving your scalping technique Common pitfalls to avoid while scalping Don't miss out on elevating your trading game Watch the video and make sure to leave a comment with your thoughts or questions. If you find this content helpful, consider subscribing for more trading tips and strategies. We will try not to make the video too long. We hope that you will definitely like this strategy video. First of all let us know about trading tools. The upper and down arrow indicator we see in the chart is called the logical trading indicator. The green and red histogram indicator we see in the chart is called the ADX histogram with DI lines indicator. Now we tell you how we want to trade. Let's start the video. We open the Bitcoin 15 minute chart. This strategy works well on the 15 minute time frame, as this strategy is unique as no one has ever told you about it before. Let us know and understand trading setup. First of all, we will search the logical trading indicator in the search box of TradingView. After that we have to click on logical trading indicator option. In which we have to change some setting. We have to change this ATR multiple option from 2 to 3. We have to change this ATR period option from 4 to 5. We have to change this basis type option from EMA to SMA. We have to change this basis length option from 18 to 21. We have to keep these options hide. After that we have to apply another indicator on the chart. We will search ADX histogram with DI lines in the search box of TradingView. After that we have to click on ADX histogram with DI lines option. In which we have to change some setting. We have to change this ADX DI length option from 14 to 16. We have to change this ADX threshold option from 20 to 21. Now our setup is ready. If you get to learn something new on our channel, then do subscribe to our YouTube channel. Let's see how we use these trading setups. When the logical trading indicator gives us a sell signal. When the ADX histogram with DI lines should be red histogram. When the market forms a bearish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place sell order. Our stop loss is to be placed at the high of the previous candle of the signal candle. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. Let us now understand the long position. When the logical trading indicator gives us a buy signal. When the ADX histogram with DI lines should be green histogram. When the market forms a bullish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place by order. Our stop loss is to be placed at the low of the previous candle of the signal candle. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. I hope you must have liked this trading setup and strategy. If not, then it doesn't matter. We are going to see examples of some trades, so that you will definitely understand. Here the logical trading indicator gives us a sell signal. Here the ADX histogram with DI lines red histogram. Here market has made a bearish candle to give confirmation. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are placing an order to sell. Our stop loss is to be placed at the high of the previous candle of the signal candle. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit.
We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. We have got the signal. Here the logical trading indicator gives us a buy signal. Here the ADX histogram with DI lines green histogram. Here market has made a bullish candle to give confirmation. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place by order. Our stop loss is to be placed at the low of the previous candle of the signal candle. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. We have got the signal. Here the logical trading indicator gives us a sell signal. Here the ADX histogram with DI lines red histogram. Here market has made a bearish candle to give confirmation. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are placing an order to sell. Our stop loss is to be placed at the high of the previous candle of the signal candle. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have lost this trade. Never mind, sometimes it happens in the market. We must remember one thing that no strategy works 100% in the market. Let's find the next trade. We have got the signal. Here the logical trading indicator gives us a buy signal. Here the ADX histogram with DI lines green histogram. Here market has made a bullish candle to give confirmation. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place by order. Our stop loss is to be placed at the low of the previous candle of the signal candle. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. We have won the trade. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more trading tips and strategies, don't forget to check out my other videos. I'd love to hear about your experiences, so drop a comment below and let's chat about your trading journey. Thanks for watching, and happy trading.